Hey, good evening, Map here, Map Investments. Today was uh, another great day. Uh, in my case, I had a record day. Did over a hundred trades. Um, markets were okay. I mean, wasn't really moving much. The small caps were moving a lot. Let me go to this page here because this tells you the closing price for the uh, for the day. Um, so the Dow Jones was down 68, S&P uh, 14, and the NASDAQ 16. But the big mover was the small caps. And I, I focus a lot on small caps. I study a lot of small caps. And that's what I, I like to buy. Um, let me see here if it shows you what the small caps was at. Uh, index... The small caps were 43. Here you go, the Russell. They were 43, over 2%. So small caps bucking the trend. I have a lot of small caps, so I did I did great today. So let me go back over here because this one doesn't have a closing price. So right now here are the futures. They're open, that's six. And uh, let's take a look at the dollar. The dollar is stable. Incredible, but stable. Just got fin. I just finished watching Biden talk about the uh, stimulus, and talked about like 1.9 billion. Uh, I mean, not not billion, trillion, trillion, um, for infrastructure, for rental assistance, for unemployment assistance, for food assistance. So a lot of money, a lot of debt coming out. Um, dollars stable. You can look at the currencies here. Uh, Aussie down a little bit, pound up a little bit, Looney down a little bit, Euro down a little bit, Yen a little positive, Mexican peso a little positive, New Zealand down a little bit, Swiss franc down a little bit, Bitcoin up 110 dollars, almost 40k, I think it was over 40k today, um, maybe do another video on cryptos, that's another topic, uh, oil up 12 cents, S&P flat, down two, gold uh, up one, just a little bit flat, copper under 370, small caps giving back a little bit, down 650, uh, where's the NASDAQ, NASDAQ up 750, Dow, uh, Dow Jones down 30, NAC gas 267, uh, Palladium Platinum pretty flat, Silver pretty flat, VIX down a little bit, the grains pretty flat, bonds up 16 ticks to 30 year, and the 10 year is up for almost five ticks, four and a half. Um, all right, so those are the futures. Let's go to my orders, see what we did today. So, uh like I said, I had 100 orders. I, I did 100 trades today, over 100. I was pretty busy. This is what I do for a living. And uh, today was a good day. I, I must say it's a really good day. I'm long the markets. Uh, I have a lot of delta, so I'm long the market right now. And uh, if I need to hedge, I'll hedge in, you know, in a click in a click of a button. I can hedge my account if I wanted to. Okay, so the first trade uh, was close ACB. For 50% profit, uh, marijuana play, close that out. Um, then the next one was a calendar spread that I closed out because it was in the money. The the January that expires tomorrow, MUR is at $15, so that wasn't in the money. And the one further out is in the money as well, which was April. Very small profit. So took that off because it's in the money and expires tomorrow. Uh, butterfly and T TCM, T uh, Taiwan Semiconductor, uh, that was a full loss. That blew through my butterfly, took a full loss on that one. Uh, what do we got here? Genesis, uh, G, uh, GNSS, I rolled the 7.5 put out from January because it's in the money, out to February for a credit of $0.40, cents, so I'm still in that position. Uh, I bought back AQB for a 50% profit. 
that's that fish stock that that does fishes salmon they they um they raise salmon on land and stuff like that and make them bigger quicker uh workhorse they make car uh trucks electric trucks and stuff i uh, bought back the iron condor for 50 percent profit uh lyv had to close that out full loss uh i day traded ipwr a couple times that one seems like it's in play and i currently have the stock and i'll go through them all so you can see what i have and what i'm looking at and then you can maybe make a list of the stocks i have because i'm not making videos on all the stocks that i'm buying maybe the ones that are pretty popular or that you know they blew up or whatever um and ask uh, co i closed that for a full loss uh big c closed iron condor I made money on that one uh i had to close a lot of stuff out today because tomorrow is expiration friday on the monthlies so i gotta close out whatever i have left probably have a probably another five left for tomorrow that i'm that i'm waiting for the last minute and i'm not rolling lift i closed out for a full loss uh, gas I closed out for a full loss FRSX I day traded and I made uh, a little bit I bought and sold in the same day I have no position right now plan I closed for a full loss SGMO I closed for a full loss RXT I closed uh, for a little gain uh, remember these are all like all stuff that's expiring tomorrow so I gotta get out of them OPK, I closed for a little gain. Apple, this I closed for a uh, loss. Uh, I bought ANVS, so I'm long ANVS, 100 shares. I bought, uh, no, actually I sold a calendar that uh, for NK, it went up, made a little profit there. Uh, closed VERU for a full loss on that one. Um, a lot of the a lot of the first ones are just closing to 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 close the positions, cause um, I have to close them. I'm not gonna roll them, whatever. I just have to close them. They're they're losses already. Um, this was a scalp on the future. The MK. Uh, I closed ADMA for a little profit. Uh, VERI was a close for a full loss. Valley was also a close for a full loss. PRTS, little gain. I rolled uh, WTRH, the four put. I rolled it out to uh, February, so I'm still in the trade. I rolled VXRT, the 750 put, out to February for $1.10, still in the trade. Uh, shift technologies uh the the car platform i rolled the 10 put for 67 cents i'm still in that trade gsx uh gsk i closed that out for a small profit because it's in the money aci i closed that out for good 50 percent profit um i bought a calendar in sd uh oil play I bought a calendar in WIT, an Indi Indian uh, technology play. I did a calendar in LXRX. Uh, here's the day trades on IPWR and FRX. I'm sorry, RFRSX. Close those. Uh, I did a calendar in FINV, and I bought a con FINV. Did a calendar in GSAT bought 200 shares of X, uh, SXTC. Uh, here's the day trade on iPower. I bought another, I'm holding a little bit of that. Here are some scalps on futures, not not relevant. Didn't really do much on that. I was trying to scalp the, 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 the micro futures, but we're not getting a lot of movement, so. And there's not a lot of premium out there. That's why you see a lot of calendars. Uh, Closed, uh, I rolled the uh, PEI uh, uh, $2 uh, put. I rolled it out to February. I bought THBR. I bought a gold future contract, which I'm holding. Uh, I bought back my strangle in silver 
for a small profit. I bought 500 shares of UAMY uh, penny stock. Uh, Casa, I bought a call out in time. A this is another scalp, scalp on future here. Dogs, I made good money on dogs. It popped today. Chinese, uh, Chinese deal. I was holding shares for a while, uh, and it had a pop today. Uh, let me pull up the one day chart. I've had this one for a while. Uh, one day. Let me see. One day. One minute. I can see the pop there today. You see, right there, about noon. Popped up to three thirty, and that's why I went back down. I got rid of it. I had like a couple hundred shares. I owned it way down. It was it was basically consolidating, uh, and I sold it on the pop. I did a calendar in TLT, which is equivalent to the thirty-year bond. Instead of playing the thirty-year bond ZB, I did TLT. I think interest rates will probably head down a little bit. Can't afford to have too much the country's debt at high interest rate. So the Fed's gonna print more money to buy the bonds to keep rates suppressed. So that's my two cents on that. So I did a calendar spread on TLT, which is equivalent to a 30 year bond. And I did a put credit spread as well. I was all over TLT. I wanted some exposure to interest rates. You gotta be diversified. So you wanna have interest rates, you wanna have stocks, you wanna sell premium, which is like volatility, like the VIX. That's also part of your portfolio. Uh, you want commodities, interest rates, currencies, metals. So you want you want diversification. Um, bingo, bingo, uh, BNGO, I don't know if it's bingo. It just reminds me of bingo. BNGO um, has options now. So I did a put credit spread there uh, for that one to go higher. Seems like everybody likes that one. I bought 100 shares of Isia. That one seemed to be uh, bucking the trend. I sold a put on TWI. I bought 100 shares of ELYS. I bought a call out in time in PGEN. I bought 100 shares of EG, EVGN. I bought 100 shares of NSYS. I bought a call in PFSW. I bought 100 shares of PFSW as well. Strong company. Pola, I only bought 25 shares, and I think this thing blew up after hours. I, I, I didn't go I didn't go in strong enough. I, 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 it was up already. I was like, I don't want to buy a lot. And I think it was up. Look at that. $10 after hours. I should have bought 100 shares, man. Stupid. Whatever. Could have made a couple hundred bucks there. Whatever. I only bought 25 shares. Uh, what else here? I bought... I bought a P10. P10, uh, call out in time. I sold the put credit spread in GIK. Seems like it's a new SPAC. I guess that's another PFW play that I did. I was all over that stock today. They, they reported pretty good. I did a calendar in TWI as well. I did 10 put credit spreads on silver. I think with all this printing... Silver is going to go higher along with gold. I already have a gold position and I bought a future you should just saw there. So I did, I, instead of buying the future contract, I did, I did a spread on the SOV. My, uh, uh, my space, my size, bought 500 shares. CXDO, I bought 100 shares. I closed out shop Iron Condor for a small profit. What is this here? Uh, I bought a calendar in TWI. I was all over TWI. They do like tires for big machinery and stuff. Snap got killed today. I did a put credit spread and snap $10 wide. I did a put credit spread and root. I did a put credit spread and D dog. I did a broken wing butterfly in MasterCard. I sold a put credit spread in CRS. I did a, a put credit spread in Maxar, which blew up, blasted off with space. That chick Catherine, whatever from Ark, 
uh, they're talking about space and an ETF and all that. That one blew up, so I put a put credit spread. I think it's going to probably even go higher. So I did that along with space. I did space yesterday. Oh, look, I didn't even know I got filled in a butterfly. I was trying to, so I, I did get filled. I got filled in Visa, broken wing butterfly to the downside. Uh, ZIOP, I bought a calendar. Uh, DBI, uh, uh, the shoe store, I sold a put. And I did calendars in there because they're all over that stock. That stock's going higher. I did a broken wing butterfly in match.com. I bought call in FINV along with, uh, oh, I guess they filled it later in the day. I didn't even know I had a couple orders for FINV. I bought, uh, what is it? NGA? Oh, I bought the put side on NGA. I had a iron condor in there. I, 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 put, I bought the put side to close that short off. Because, I don't know, that thing's kind of high. Maybe a problem come back down. I don't know. I just closed it. Uh, NK, I also did a, a put credit spread in NK. And I did a calendar in Sting. Uh, shipper. So that's my 100 and something trades. So if you want to take notes, you got 100 and something trades that I did and stocks that I watched that were moving today. I usually do my pre-morning uh, list when I get a chance of what I'm looking at. And um, and here are the futures. Mainly look at the, the ones here. Uh, small caps are down 10 now. S&P down five, gold up one. NASDAQ pretty flat and Dow Jones down 45. So I think the market, I mean, there's just so much money being printing. But they're printing so much money. It's just crazy. I, I just don't I can't I can't see the market going down with all this money that they're printing. It's trillions and trillions and trillions of dollars. Um I can't believe the dollars hanging in there, but whatever. It is what it is. Um, I'm long. A lot of deltas, especially small caps. All those names you saw there. I have many positions. I'm not in a lot of futures right now. Not in many futures right now. And um, that's pretty much it for the market wrap for today. We'll see what tomorrow brings. We're seeing some red here. Um, like the channel. I'm almost at 100 subscribers, so I appreciate it. Uh Share the videos with your friends and family. If you have any questions or if you have any uh, stocks that you think are good, shoot them my way. I'll take a look at them. Um, so like and subscribe. I'm, I'm bringing uh, good content every day. So I think it'll be prudent for you to, to watch the videos and, and get some pics on, on, you know, on what's going on in the market. I'm not going to complain about anything. That's not my style. I'm a hustler. If you like, if 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 you're here to hear about, about complaining about the economy or politics or any of that nature, I'm not gonna give you my input on any of that stuff. I'm a market guy. I'm a hustler. I look at this stuff all day. That's all I do, and I try to make a living for my family, and that's all I do. Look at the markets, look at stocks, and try and make money, which is the 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 end result of this game. For me, it's a game. So I don't like to lose. I'm very competitive. I play baseball all my life. I have back pain, but I play baseball all my life, and I'm a competitor, and that's the way I look at this. So, so like I said, um, just uh, subscribe so you get the notification, and let's make some money together. Have a good night. I'll probably do a little uh, crypto video too as well. I transfer some money from... Uh, I have an account with Tasty. And I'm not doing much with the money that's sitting there. So I'm going to move. So, cause I'm doing most of my trading here. And as you can see, I did 100 trades here in TD. My, my money's in TD. Um, I'm going to have a transfer some money. And I'll probably start doing more of uh, like day trading or weekly trading on these cryptos. I'm still holding those three. But I'll do a couple videos on, on, the, on the cryptos as well. Have a good night. See you in the next video.